You ready to talk it? <laughs> Your mother is harder. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hello. Mr. Man. Are you awake, Mr. Man? There we go. Hello, Mr. Man. Let me see your family awake. Dad made this trip for nothing. Now. Could you please say your name loudly? Of course we know who you are. But I'd like you to identify yourself for my records. I know it's very tedious, but uh, my superiors are becoming extremely adamant about proper procedure, even for nails like you. So could you please speak loudly and say, what is your name? Fuck off. I'm sorry, could you repeat that? Fuck off, you sigh! <laughs> Mr. Miles, I don't need to remind you of the seriousness of your situation. Whether you'd rather or not acknowledge it, your life has been brought down to a rather simplified view. If I may be very blunt with you, despite my job title as an interrogator, I really have no talent for it. So I'll simply point out to you two choices, or rather, opportunities that you have at the moment. One, you give me the names and locations of every single person in this little Neil revolt, as well as their base of operations. I'll write all of this down onto a simple piece of paper, and then you will have to sign this, which will give you a full pardon from the council, and you'll be able to walk out that door right there, a free man. The second opportunity, however, is a stark contrast. You don't answer my questions. You keep up your false bravado. You don't tell me anything about where your friends, your family, everyone dealing with this is. And you will have my utmost respect. <sighs> but then I put away this recorder and I start doing what I am very good at. Well, let's try that again. What is your name? You ain't getting nothing out of me. You look like you're tired, especially after working with him of all people. Why don't you go out, take a break, get something to drink? Sir. And do close the door on your way out. <sighs> you know, you almost ruined a good suit. Pay attention, Mr. Miles. Can you join me over here? What the hell did you do to me? Can I tell you something, Ethan? I can call you Ethan, correct? We are both friends here. Pardon me. You see, size now and day... Very, very much disgusts me. They don't understand the true ability of facing to wipe one mind clean. They just simply do it. There's no technique. There's no refined ability. They just destroy a mind with one touch. Phasing is an art. 
similar to how a composer writes his symphony, or an artist creates his masterpiece. It takes a certain touch, a devotion, if you will. Both of which I have. The fuck you do to me? Simply put, Mr. Miles, I've made my first stroke on a brand new canvas. You're mine. I think, therefore I am. Don't you see it, Mr. Mom? The ability to think defines us as human. We use our experiences, our memories, as guidelines on how to think, how to act, how to be. But, what happens when you no longer think? What happens when I take away all your memories and experiences of walking? Then, your mind's just sending random information to your legs, but they don't know what to do with it. So what happens when I take more? What happens when I take away your ability to touch? What happens when I take away all your memories and experiences that make you you? You still didn't exist as Ethan Miles. Hmm. You exist as Ethan Miles. Well, there's only one way to find out. WAIT! Let's try this again. What is your name? Ethan Miles. And what, Ethan Miles, is your classification? I'm a new sir. Thank you. And the next raid is in two weeks. Food rations are becoming scarce, and the leaders are worried about keeping the soldiers in line. Strife among the masses. Eh, how very nail like. Hmm. Well, I think that's everything that I need. Oh, that just leaves one last thing to do. I, I told you everything. You said I can go. Hmm. Well, Mr. Miles, I am in my word. And I did say I'd let you go. But. My job is simply to get the information out of you. After that, well, I get to have my fun. So, where should we begin? I personally like to work backwards to front. You know, let my work evolve in front of me. Oh, you know what? I think I'll start with the last 72 hours. Don't worry, I'll leave our time together for last. <laughs> Where am I? Good to see you again. Now let's try for one year. <laughs> and five. <laughs> ten. <laughs> a few more and you should be a great schooler. Molly, why does it hurt? Make the bad man go away. I love my body. <sighs> for the last drop of life on Mr. Ethan Miles. It's been fun. Ah, let's see if he still remembers me. <laughs> well, my work here is done. Dang it. I'm supposed to be in the sign now.